I am exhausted with the wickedness of women in my country. I am tired, especially black women. I don't understand how many of us have to drop dead first. Do we have to be such a big number that the mortality rate would, re would result in a reduction in the percentage of females at all in the country? Must there be a double digit percentage decline in the number of women in comparison to men before they will react appropriately to their inappropriate handing over of women to horrible men that they know are horrible. I've been suffering from the exact same pulsating issue for 10 years. Fellow women literally sitting around waiting for me to eventually embrace the pursuit of an evil man. The evil man of which are not just, is not just one, but many. There have been so many men in this 10 year season of me suffering that have tried to take me that have tried to just imagine me something on the stock exchange to trade with, something that they can call dibs on, something that they can just dust off, like a little shiny thing you pick up on the floor and then you put it in your house as an ornament. I have had such worthless men insist upon me because they made an observation that women have left me to be insisted upon by men who have the brazen audacity to call dibs on a whole living soul, having no regard for the sanctity, therefore, of human life. When I am a prayerful woman who came to Christ in 2011, prayed in the Lord, consecrated myself to him, asking him for a husband, and I must just allow myself to get taken by somebody who thoroughly went on right ahead out of a plethora of 20 men called dibs on me. And women are the ones who put me in harm's way to be devoured by such dastardly men as these. This here, ladies, is the South Africa you have created as a result of your complacency and your complicitness, therefore, of causing gender-based violence in the country. This nation is the worst one to live in as a woman. South Africa is the worst nation statistically to live in as a woman because here we get beaten and here we get killed. It is not just the men that are la dog killing of their own volition. It is that they've got a partner in crime like Bonnie and Clyde and that partner in crime are fellow females. They are leaving fellow women at the feet of disgusting men and then celebrating with one another because hey misery loves company at least we all have bad husbands until one of you dies all the best with that